update for the summer event 2018 in Forge of Empires. On Thursday, August 2nd, 2018, the summer event will begin. Based on the beta server, I already provided a first impression of this event. In the meantime, InnoGames received a lot of feedback from players and InnoGames made a number of changes based on this feedback. The most important thing first. InnoGames provided a clear agreement that a player who plays the whole event should be able to receive a ship of the highest level without paying diamonds. This is a clear commitment to the free-to-play concept. Thank you very much, InnoGames. This has been implemented by several changes. The rewards of the quest line received an additional upgrade kit. As before, the ship is rewarded for completing the fourth quest. Then you get upgrade kits for completing quests 19, 43 and 51. In between, you receive another 12 doubloons. This also helps. Second change. There are more maps on the wheel. Therefore, your ship makes a better progress after each spin of the Wheel of Fortune. With a little luck, you get a wheel with seven or more additional maps. Those who intentionally focus on wheels with more maps will receive more grand prizes. You see a complete treasure hunt in time lapse getting completed after 10 spins of the Wheel of Fortune. Advancing faster results in receiving more grand prizes. You will receive 22 additional doubloons for the quests. This will enable you to spin the wheel 22 times more. This is equivalent to at least one grand prize, if not two. The result is fantastic. Those who complete the quest line will have the possibility to upgrade the ship to level 7, independent of how you act on the Wheel of Fortune. Those who have a little luck and focus on wheels with more maps can upgrade a second ship on a level between 3 and 5. More relevant changes are related to the prices on the Wheel of Fortune. These are much more attractive now. Each wheel now will have a golden price. On top, each wheel will have two or three silver prices. The selection kit got better prices inside and therefore they are now golden prices. Less attractive prices have been removed completely from golden and silver prices. The ships level 7 now all have a unique boost. Pirate ship 8% attack boost. Royal ship 10% coin boost. Trader ship 10% supply boost. I will also update the video about the event building soon. In the meantime, the event ended on the beta server. Looking back, I can say that the quest line was relatively simple. Everybody can complete it without spending too much time for it. It is absolutely great that InnoGames responds in the right way to players' feedback. If you have friends who think about playing Forge of Empires, let them know that now is a very good time to start. A new city would be ready in time to participate in the event. The very attractive event rewards will boost especially new cities significantly. I think we all will have a lot of fun with this great event.